Okay, so for the head, we're going to start with the magic ring and then six single crochet into the magic ring. So I already did that. So now in our second row, we're going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches. Okay, so we're going to go into the next stitch. Okay, and increase. Okay, and also increase in the next stitch. Okay, increase. Okay, so you're going to continue increasing all the way to the end. Okay, so now in our third row, we're going to do single crochet, then increase. And we're going to repeat that all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. And then we're going to keep repeating that. So single crochet, increase. Okay and continue repeating that all the way round okay so now in our fourth row we're going to do two single crochet then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 24 stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one two and then increase in the next stitch Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that. So two single crochets and increase. Okay, so continue repeating that all the way round. Okay, so now in our fifth row, we are going to do three single crochet, then increase and repeat all around for a total of 30 stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one two three and then increase and then repeat that again so three single crochets and increase Okay, so repeat that all the way to the end. Okay, so after that now in the sixth row, we are going to do four single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 36 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, and then increase and then we're going to keep repeating that so four single crochet one two three four and then increase Okay, and continue one two three four and increase okay so continue all the way to the end okay so now in our seventh row uh, we're going to do five single crochet then increase and repeat all around for a total of 42 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and then increase and keep repeating that so 
single crochet one two three four five and increase okay so repeat that all the way to the end okay so now after that uh, for the next seven rows which is from row 8 until row 14 you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of uh, 42 stitches in each row okay so I'll see you when you're done with the 14th row so that we start the 15th row together okay so now after the 14th row this is how uh, our head should look like so now in our 15th row we are going to start decreasing and we're going to start by doing five single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 36 stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and then decrease And then we're going to keep repeating that so five single crochets one two three four five and then decrease okay and then you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end Okay, so after that, now in our 16th row, uh, we're going to do four single crochet, then decrease and repeat all around for a total of 30 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet one, two, three, four, and then decrease. And then you're going to keep repeating that so four single crochet and then decrease okay and then you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end Okay, so now in our 17th row, we're going to start by doing three single crochet, then decrease and repeat all around for a total of 24 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, and then decrease. And then we're going to keep repeating that. So three single crochet, one, two, three, and decrease. Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end. Okay, so after that, now in our 18th row, we're going to do two single crochet, then decrease and repeat all around for a total of 18 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, and then decrease. And then we're going to keep repeating that. So two single crochets. And then decrease. Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end okay so after that now in the last row of the body which is row to uh, 19 we are going to do single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 12 stitches so we're going to do single crochet and then decrease and then you're going to keep repeating that so single crochet decrease 
okay and then you're going to continue like that all the way to the end okay so after you're done with the 19th row now we're going to go into the next stitch and then you're going to slip stitch and then after that uh, I'm just going to cut my yarn and leave it long enough for sewing okay and then after you're done with that uh, you're going to stuff your head fully all the way to the end and then after that we're going to start making the ears okay so for the ears you're going to start first with the magic ring and stick single crochet into the magic ring in the first row so I already did that so now we're going to start off in the second row and in our second row we're going to start by increasing in the first stitch okay so we're going to increase okay and then we're going to do two single crochets so we're going to do single crochet one and single crochet also in the next stitch and then after that we're going to increase in the next stitch Okay, and then in the remaining two stitches we're going to do single crochet each so single crochet and the last stitch also okay so we'll have a total of eight stitches okay so now we're going to go into the third row so let me close the gap first okay so now in the third row we're going to start by doing single crochet in the next stitch okay so i'm going to do single crochet and then i'm going to increase in the next stitch increase okay and then i'm going to do three single crochets so we're going to do single crochet one single crochet two and single crochet three okay and then after that i'm going to increase in the next stitch so we're going to do an increase And then we'll do single crochet in the remaining two stitches so single crochet and single crochet so we'll have a total of 10 stitches okay so now in our fourth row we're going to start by doing single crochet in the next two stitches so we're going to do single crochet one single crochet two and then we're going to increase in the next stitch so increase okay and then we're going to do four single crochets so single crochet one two three and Four. okay and then we're going to increase in the next stitch increase and then we're going to do single crochet in the remaining two stitches so a single crochet and single crochet okay so that makes it a total of 12 stitches okay so now in our fifth row we're going to start by doing three single crochets so we're going to do single crochet one two three and then we're going to increase in the next stitch we're going to increase okay and then we're going to do five single crochets so we're going to do single crochet one two three four 
4 and 5 okay and then after the five single crochets we are going to increase in the next stitch so we're going to do an increase and then do single crochet in the remaining two stitches single crochet and single crochet okay so uh, we'll have a total of 14 stitches okay so now in our sixth row we're going to start by doing four single crochets so we do single crochet one two three four and then we're going to increase in the next stitch so increase and then we'll do six single crochets so one two three four five and six okay and then we'll increase in the next stitch so do an increase and then single crochet in the remaining two stitches do single crochet and single crochet okay so we'll have a total of 16 stitches okay so now in our seventh row we'll start by doing five single crochets so do single crochet one two three four five and then increase in the next stitch increase and then single crochet in the next seven stitches so single crochet one two three four five six seven and then we're going to increase in the next stitch so increase and then single crochet in the remaining two stitches single crochet single crochet okay so we'll have a total of 18 stitches okay so now in our eighth row we're going to start by doing six single crochet so we're going to start do one two three okay so continue until you have six single crochets okay so after the six single crochet we're going to increase in the next stitch so increase and then we're going to do single crochet in the next eight stitches so we'll do one two okay so continue until you have eight single crochets okay so after the eight single crochets in the next stitch we are going to increase so increase and then do single crochet in the remaining two stitches so single crochet single crochet so we'll have a total of 20 stitches okay so now in our ninth row we're going to start by doing seven single crochets so we're going to do one two three okay so continue until you have seven single crochets okay so after the seven single crochets we're going to increase in the next stitch so we're going to do an increase and then after that we're going to do nine single crochets so we're going to do one two three 
three okay and then you're going to continue until you have nine single crochets okay so after the nine single crochets we are going to increase in the next stitch and then we'll do single crochet in the remaining two stitches okay so we'll have a total of 22 stitches okay so now in our 10th row we're going to start by doing eight single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three and continue until you have eight single crochets okay so after the eight single crochets we're going to increase in the next stitch so you're going to do an increase and then do 10 single crochets so we'll do one two three four and continue until you have 10 single crochets okay so after the 10 single crochets we're going to increase in the next stitch and then we'll do single crochet in the remaining two stitches so we'll do single crochet and single crochet okay so now in our 11th row we're going to start by doing nine single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three four and continue until you have nine single crochets okay so after the nine single crochets we're going to increase in the next stitch so do an increase and then we're going to do 11 single crochets so we do single crochet one two three and continue until you have nine single crochets okay so after the 11 single crochets we're going to increase in the next stitch and then do single crochet in the remaining two stitches okay so now in our top row we're going to start by doing 10 single crochets so we do one two three four and continue until you have 10 stitches okay so after the 10 single crochets we're going to increase in the next stitch so we're going to do an increase and then after that we're going to do 12 single crochets so you'll do one two three and continue until you have 12 stitches okay so after the 12 stitches we're going to increase in the next stitch and then we're going to do single crochet in the remaining two stitches so we do single crochet and then single crochet Okay, so now we're going to start with our 13th row and in our 13th row we're going to start by doing 11 single crochets two one two three four continue until you have 11 single crochets okay so after the 11 single crochets we're going to increase in the next stitch we're going to increase and then we'll do 13 single crochets so it's single crochet one two three four and continue until you have 13 single crochets okay so after the 13 single crochets we are going to increase in the next stitch And then we'll do single crochet in the remaining two stitches okay so until now we have a total of 30 stitches okay so now for the next four rows which is from row 14 until row 17 we're going to do single crochet all the way in each row for a total of 
uh, 30 stitches in each row okay so please do a single crochet from row 14 until row 17 and then i'll see you when you're done with the 17th row so that we start the 18th row together okay so guys after the 17th row this is how our ear looks like so now in our 18th row we're going to do 13 single crochet then decrease and then do again 13 single crochet and decrease at the end okay so we're going to start by doing single crochet one two three four five okay continue until you have 13 single crochets Okay, so after the 13 single crochets, we are going to decrease one time. So we're going to decrease. Okay, and then again, we're going to do 13 single crochets. So do one, two, three, four five and continue until you have 13 single crochets okay so after the 13 single crochets we're going to decrease here at the end okay so we're going to do one decrease okay so now uh in our 19th row we're going to start by doing 12 single crochets so we do single crochet One, two, three, four. Okay, continue until you have 12 single crochets. Okay, so after the 12 single crochets, we are going to decrease again one time. And then we are going to do again 12 single crochets. So we do one two three four five okay and continue until you have 12 single crochets okay so after that we're going to decrease again here at the end Okay, so now in our 20th row, we're going to do 11 single crochet, then decrease, then 11 single crochet, and decrease again. Okay, so do one, two, three, and then you continue until you have 11 single crochets. Okay, so after that, we're going to decrease here one time. Okay, and then we're going to do again 11 single crochets so one two three and continue until you have 11 single crochets okay so after that uh, you have two stitches remaining and you're going to decrease at the end Okay, so for the 21st row, uh, we're going to start by doing 10 single crochets. So we'll do 1, 2, 3, 4, and we'll continue until we have 10 single crochets. Okay, so after the 10 stitches, we are going to decrease one time. Okay, and then after that, we'll do again 10 single crochets. So we'll do one, two, three, four, and continue until you have 10 single crochets. Okay, so after the 10 stitches, again, we're going to decrease here at the end. OK, 
okay so now in our 22nd row we're going to start by doing nine single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three and continue until you have nine single crochets okay and then after that we're going to do again nine single crochets so we'll do one two three four and continue until you have nine single crochets okay so after that in the last two stitches we are going to decrease okay so now in our 23rd row you know the pattern how it goes we're going to start by doing eight single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three and continue until you have eight single crochets okay so after the eight stitches we are going to decrease one time okay and then after that we'll do again eight single crochets so we continue and do one two three okay all the way until you have eight single crochets okay, so after that in the last two stitches we are going to decrease Okay, so now in our 24th row we're going to start by doing seven single crochets so we do single crochet one two three and continue until you have seven single crochets okay, so after that next we're going to decrease Okay, and then again we're going to do other seven single crochets so we're going to continue and do one two three and continue until you have seven single crochets okay and then after that in the last two stitches we're going to decrease Okay, so now in the 23rd row we're going to start by doing six single crochet so we do single crochet one two three four five six and then decrease And then we'll do again six single crochets so one two three four five six and decrease in the last two stitches okay so now in the 22nd row we're going to start by doing five single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three four five and then we'll decrease then repeat again five single crochets so one two three four five and decrease in the last two stitches ok 
Okay, so after you're done with that, now in the next six stitches, uh, six rows, which is from row 21 until row 26, we're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 12 stitches in each row. Okay, so after you're done with those six rows, your ear should look like this. And then when you get to the end, uh, which is the 26th row, you're just going to cut off your yarn and leave yarn long enough for sewing. Okay, so for the hands, we're going to start to the magic ring and then six single crochets into the magic ring. And then after that, uh, in the second row, we're going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches. So I'm going to go into the next stitch and increase. Okay, and then I'm going to increase in the next stitch also. Okay, so you're going to continue increasing. Okay, so increase all the way round. Okay, so after that now, in our third row, we're going to do single crochet in the next five stitches, then increase, and we're going to do that two times. Okay, so I'm going to go into the next stitch and do single crochet. One. two, three, four, five, and increase. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that again one more time. So you're going to do five single crochet and then increase. Okay, so after that now in round four and five, you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 14 stitches in each row. So I'll see you when you're done with the next two rows until row five so that we start the sixth row together. Okay, so now after the fifth row, this is how it's, it looks like. So now in our sixth row, we're going to do five single crochet, then decrease, and then we're going to do that two times. Okay, so we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, and then decrease. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that again one more time. So five single crochet and then decrease. Okay, so after you're done with that, now for the next two rows, which is row 7 and row 8, we are going to do single crochet all the way around in each row uh, for a total of 12 stitches in each row. Okay, so do single crochet for the next two rows and then we start the ninth row together. Okay, so now in our ninth row, we are going to start by doing single crochet in the next five stitches. So we're going to do single crochet one, two, three, four, and five, and then decrease. Okay, and then after that, you're going to do single crochet in the remaining five stitches. So we'll have a total of 11 stitches. Okay, so after that, now in our 10th row, we're going to start by doing single crochet in the next four stitches. So we're going to do single crochet. One. two, three, and four, and then we're going to decrease. OK, 
okay and then after that you're going to do single crochet in the remaining five stitches so we'll have a total of 10 stitches so after you're done with that now for the next uh, nine rows which is from row 11 until row 19 uh, we're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 10 stitches in each row okay but before you continue make sure you start here at the bottom okay so after you're done uh, your arm is gonna look something like this so you're just going to add nine more rows all the way around and then when you're done cut off your yarn and leave it long enough for sewing so i just stuffed it here at the bottom and then i didn't stuff the upper part uh, because that's how i like my arm to look like but you can stuff it a little bit if you want to so now after that uh we're going to start making the muzzle okay so for the muzzle we're going to use the white yarn as you can see and we're going to start with the magic ring and six single crochet into the magic ring so i already did that so now in our second row we are going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches okay so i'm going to go into the next stitch and increase Okay, also next stitch, increase. Okay, we're going to continue increasing. Okay, so you're going to continue increasing all the way round okay so now in our third round we're going to do single crochet then increase and repeat all the way for a total of 18 stitches so we're going to do single crochet then increase in the next stitch okay and we're going we're going to keep repeating that so single crochet and increase okay so you're going to keep repeating the same pattern all the way to the end okay in our fourth row now we're going to do two single crochet then increase and repeat all around for a total of 24 stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one two and then increase okay and then continue so single crochet two and then increase okay so you're going to continue like that all the way to the end okay so after that now for the next three rows which are the last rows of the muzzle we are going to do single crochet all the way around for a total of 24 stitches okay so for the next three rows which is from row 5 until row 7 please do single crochet all the way to the end and then when you're done you're just going to cut off the yarn and leave it long enough for sewing okay so guys as you can see i've already finished attaching all the parts together so for the ears you attach them between the first second third uh, between the fourth and the fifth row or on the fourth row this is how i attach them and also for the uh, muzzle i embroidered the little mouth over here so what you do first is uh, you make a triangle so you put your needle through here and then remove it through this other side and then again you go through this other side and you keep making the same triangular shape and then also i put i embroidered the little mouth uh below here and also remember to stuff your muzzle before you close it you close it all through and because i didn't have the doll eyes i used these little buttons over here so for the scarf as you can see i did a chain so long enough to tie it through first you have to measure the length that you want and then after that you just do double crochet all the way through to the end 
okay and also you can see i embroidered the little poles over here so what i did is i did one two three three lines of embroidery and also same of the arms and that's it guys so the joining the parts together it's quite easy so what you do first you have to join the hands to the body first and then after that you join the head and then you start attaching all the other parts okay so i hope you guys enjoyed this pattern if you have any question uh, please post it in the comments below and also if you haven't subscribed to my channel subscribe i upload uh, one video every week and until next time bye